Hi, Paula continuing to share my journey with games with young children at the Siam Bloom School. When I arrived on the sixth visit, Ritika was the one that jumped up this time, so I started with her. And we, what we did, I'll show you, these are some of the elements. So I have them in a box and together we sorted them, we made little piles. And then I gave him her the medium pattern cards and she was putting them on top and finding where they match. Then Small blue. Where's small blue? Where's small blue? it on top. Yes. Now no moving, then same. Go. You do. Here. Wait, this is the bad one. Here. No turning. Yeah. Put it right into the center. Okay. Then, what's here? And she stayed so focused doing this the whole time. Incredible. Then it was, I looked, it was half an hour. For half an hour, she was completely focused. And I said to her, do you want to play a game? And she wanted to play cooperative memory. So I went back to class and I got... Sairam and Giri Daran was not there, so I took another girl, Roshika. So Ritika, Roshika, and Sairam and myself, we played cooperative memory, and it was a lot of fun. Uh, Ritika is getting much better at giving people turns and staying focused, and after we played, Ritika still wanted to stay. So she stayed and they saw what she had done with the elements building on the pattern card. So they wanted to do that too. So they, all three were doing it in different places in the room. And then the snack bell rang and that meant that Ritika had kept her focused. It got a little shaky at the end, but for the most part, she was present and focused for the whole time, which was one hour. Incredible. So if you want to continue to share this journey into games with me, please subscribe to my channel. Bye for now.